what is up youtube welcome welcome back to my channel i'm back with another video in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how to do this clear but pink lip gloss with pink butterflies and before we get started follow me on instagram and tiktok and subscribe to my channel give me a like and a comment and let's just get straight into this video so we're going to start off with a bowl and make sure your gloves are on and you can use any bowl but i prefer something that's like glass or clear and I got these from Dollar Tree, so you can purchase them from there. And we're going to be using TKB Trading Bursa Gel. And just add the amount, you know, you think you're going to be using. And I kind of eye it because I know which amount I need since I've been doing lip gloss for quite a while now. And I was kind of at the end of this lip gloss and it was hard to take it all out. And later on in the video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to take the Versagel all the way out, like the little bit that's stuck inside. I will show you guys in just a little bit. So now I'm going to be using this coconut oil that I purchased off from Amazon. So you can find that there. And I'm just going to add a little bit. Again, I just kind of eye it and then i'm gonna go ahead with this vitamin e oil i also purchased it all from amazon and we're gonna go with this flavoring oil which is cherry and this is what is gonna give me the color i'm not gonna use no color or pigment i'm just gonna use flavoring oil which is cherry and it's red or pink dark pink i don't know so now we're just going to mix this all up until you get the desired color you want. And I'm going for like a light pink or dark pink. So let's see if that comes out. But if you want to add color, that's up to you. But for this specific lip gloss, I just didn't want any color. Just a light pink for a clear lip gloss. All right, so here's the trick, guys. Get something flat, a remote or something. I use my remote because I always do. I don't know, it always works. But get something flat and hard so that way you can just basically um, press down on it and then all the way to the top. And it will literally squeeze all the, lip, the Versagel. I don't know how, but this just works. So let's say you're at the end and you really want to take all the Versagel out. This is what you got to do and look it's all the way in the top and then you take it all out and then keep on doing it until you take all the versagel out because girl do not put that in the trash you're basically wasting your money versagel is very expensive so this is the trick I added a little more of the cherry scent just to make sure that, you know, it, it, sm it smells exactly like cherry. And on top of that, I just wanted my lip gloss a little bit more pink because it was just too clear. And I just wanted it pink for some reason. I don't even know why, but at the end of the day, it still gives out a clear lip gloss on the lips. So you just mix and mix until you get your desired look or consistency. Sometimes I add a little bit more of oil, 
because throughout the process i feel like i just need a little bit more and then i just mix and mix until i am satisfied with the look and consistency i like to do a lip gloss that is not too thin and not too thick that is very perfect and moisturizing and this is exactly how it looks Now we're going to add the holographic butterflies and I'm going to be using the color pink. I will be leaving the link in the, down in the description below so you can purchase as well. So we're going to add a decent amount of butterflies because I feel like the more you add, the more it will show and pop out on the lip gloss. And it also depends how much lip gloss you are doing. So now I'm just basically going to mix that up. Just look how beautiful that looks. Now we are going to get our syringe and we're just basically gonna suck in the lip gloss. Instead of scooping it, I would prefer sucking in the lip gloss and no, the butterflies do not get stuck, which is a good thing if it's right through the um, syringe and pipette. So um, yeah, just suck it up, don't scoop. I feel like that's too much work and too messy. Sucking it up is just so much easier. So please, I recommend doing this. And this is one of the tubes how it looked like and I'm going on with my next tube and I'm going to be using the squeeze method. Basically what you do is you add a little bit of lip gloss at the bottom and once you do that you squeeze and the reason why you squeeze because you want to make sure the whole tube is full of lip gloss and there is no bubbles and then you just fill it up all the way to the top and then you're done filling the tube. So I only do this if I don't have pipettes or I'm just sick and tired of using the pipette because sometimes it just comes off or I have to keep taking it off to suck in more lip gloss. So this is a good method, but it also takes up more time.
so this is a swatch of the lip gloss as i said earlier this is a clear lip gloss it just looks pink and it smells so good like cherry it's amazing and this is the final results of my lip glosses with the pink butterflies i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like and subscribe and follow me on all my social medias tiktok and instagram and i'll see you on my next one